human ankle is pretty amazing. First, there are the seven tarsal bones. There's the talus, which articulates with the tibia and fibula. There's the calcaneus, which is your heel bone. That's connected to the cuboid bone, which is surprisingly not shaped like a cube. There's the navicular bone, which connects with the three cuneiform bones, followed by the metatarsals and the phalanges. Stabilizing the ankle joint, we have the deltoid ligament, which prevents excessive outward rotation or eversion of the foot. And on the lateral side of the ankle, we have the lateral collateral ligament, which prevents over inversion or inward rotation. And to move our ankle joint, the tibialis anterior pulls up on the foot to cause dorsiflexion. The gastrocnemius, soleus, and plantaris pull up on the calcaneus to cause plantar flexion. The tibialis anterior and tibialis posterior pull up on the medial side of the foot to cause inversion. Whereas the fibularis longus, brevis, and tertius pull up on the lateral side of the foot to cause eversion. Check out the link for my full lesson on the ankle joint and for more amazing 3D models from Anatomage's digitized cadavers, check out anatomage.com.